you know, what makes a good content creator? It's something that's been on my mind for a little while, and I'm not here to say that I know the ins and outs of what actually needs to happen, but in my time that I've done in streaming, it's very interesting to me to see how many facets you have to be a part of in order to actually produce something of value for people. You see, a content creator is not only a personality or a person that you can get along with or someone that you can interact with, they have to become an audio engineer. They have to become a graphic designer. They have to become so much more than what you see every single day that it actually is very respectable to think about how much a content creator does in order to try and get good content for their audience. Now, there may just be me praising content creators because I am one and I understand the self-indulgence that I'm going to receive from saying these words to you, but it baffles me on how much is lost between what you actually have to know in order to be a streamer and what people think that you have to do. See, clicking a go live button or a start streaming button is like one one billionth of the job that is actually put before content creators today having to get your audio settings correct, having to get your bit rate correct, understanding the flow of traffic on the internet, understanding how to play a game and being good at a game, how to be whimsical and be able to react to certain situations to make funny jokes if that's the way that you want to go, having to be able to graphically design things or video edit or try to get anything done with a speck, a speck of interest from people is absolutely mind boggling to me. I don't, I can't think of another profession when you actually have to know a multitude of things in order to be good at what you're doing. Because you can go into graphic design and, and design graphics for companies and that's the only thing you focus on. You can be an audio engineer and literally just worry about sound all the time. Being a musician, you know music and you understand music and you create music. Being a writer or comedian of any sort, you, you focus on that task, but you don't have to branch into other different things to be successful. Having to be a social, a social entrepreneur and having to figure out the intricacies of each platform to understand how your audience will be able to receive your content. All of these different things coalesce together when you're trying to make a stream. And so while it might look like someone just has to click start stream, it's like, the smallest part of what actually has to happen. You have to be a room decorator. Now, I'm not saying that I am a room decorator, but I have to try and figure out stuff that might make conversation for people. Put in interesting lights, have to try and do lighting and photography with these big lights. It's, it's an astronomically difficult thing to do, but nobody really recognizes it. Now, with all that being said, once you make it big, once you have this very large income from a lot of people enjoying your content, you can start petitioning out different things. Make a YouTube team, make an Instagram team, try to make something with a PR or a manager of any sort that gets you gigs and stuff like that. That's all fine and good. But for anybody who's small, anybody who doesn't have a substantial income from it, they're not going to be able to put forth the monetary value to get those things. And that, that's where the beauty comes in. The drive, the grind, the, the story that is presented before you when you look at content creators, make it from small time to big time. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And so the next time that you go into a stream and you see someone who doesn't have the best graphics, who doesn't have the best camera, who, who might not be playing at the top of, the, of their game, understand that they're going through much more than just trying to click go live. I hope y'all take away something positive from this. Go inspire someone's day by saying hi to them in a new stream and hit that follow button for them. I'm sure they'll appreciate it more than you know.